Hello, hello, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, welcome back to the First Master 5 YouTube channel, and welcome back to some Red Dead Redemption. I don't know why I'm talking like that, bro, I'll be honest. Uh, I didn't know what I wanted to play for today, so I was like, you know what, I might just play some Red Dead, the original one, not the... Another new one, the original. Which, you know, fair enough. Uh, yeah, so how we going? How y'all doing? She's good, that's good. Let's get straight into it. Let's, let's not dilly or dally. My plan today is... Why is it... Can I just change the difficulty every time? I, I think one of the difficulties ultimately. I know that the online servers... There's no online servers for PS4. Well, I don't know that. I assume that. What do I have to do? I I am planning to take down Bill Williamson. That's my... Oh, shit. He's got a saddle on now. That's my one goal right now. It's telling me I should purchase a property. I don't have the financial facilities for that. I always forget how to check the map. Uh, so, we got that guy. Let's go speak to this Nigel West Dickens, who seems to me, well, apparently he's lost, but to me he seems like a man that just don't want to be found. Although he's not doing a very good job. See if there's collision in this game yet? Nope. I don't need to follow that shit. I don't even know how to put a marker down, bro. It's not like I'm following the road. We're going cross country. So yeah. I don't know if there's fast travel in this game. Because I haven't been to any other city yet. Oh shit, someone's firing stuff. Get the cattleman revolver out. I'm ready. I heard gunshots. Don't tell me this is a cliff, bro. This is, yep, this is the same cliff that the cows fell off. Except, how do I get down there? Oh shit, are we gonna go over there? Is that Mexico? Bro, that, that's gotta be racist. Is that a dude about to jump? Shit, look at that. Hold on, we gotta go over there. I d Alright. Let's see if he's man enough. I do not condone suicide. Oh shit, fucking... Alright, Bucky, you're definitely a Bucky because you don't go three. You force me to go around. Stupid... What the fuck is that? I... What is... Oh shit. Oh, I don't want to kill dogs, bro. Oh well. Oh, I got money. Might as well school skin the animal. Bro, it's probably gonna take away the guy that um I should have shot the guy that was being attacked, then the dogs could have eaten him. <laughs> Shouldn't have done that. The um Okay, John, so do you. There's not There's not much difference between you and a coyote, let's let's be real here. I think yeah, here's one. I'm not gonna. There's one right here. Check, hunter master, master hunter. All right, let's go. Let's go meet the guy jumping off the cliff. People have taken notice of your honorable actions. Jobs in town pay twice as much. I haven't even taken one job. Where is my horse? Why did you despawn? <laughs> Why are you over here? We need to go meet a guy on a cliff. Let's go. Well, he's probably not there anymore. Probably long gone. Oh, no, you know what? Fuck flowers. I saw him. He was... <laughs> oh, there he is. He's standing there. Look at this guy. Oh, I've, I've seen YouTube videos of this guy. We're about to get the only mention of Arthur right now. Right. Wait, what the fuck? Hello, John. John. John Marston. Come on, mute my mic. 
Do I know you? I hope so. I seem to know you. I'm pretty good at remembering faces. Are you? Do you remember Hattie McCourt's face? Who? She was a girl Dutch Vanderlyn shot in the head on that raid on the ferry a few years back. Same one you got shot on. Pretty girl. Was that the... I was hanging out by a thread of tendon, and her brain was plastered over a wall. Was that the uh, gambling one? Not really. With Hosea? And Why Arthur? You remember me, friend? At the gambling You've table? You've forgotten far more important people than me. Arthur! What's your game, friend? I don't have a game, John. Listen, sometimes I just wish... I'm gonna be I honest, I don't remember that other person life. either. I wish I'd had better guidance. A friend of mine is drunk as a skunk in the saloon on Thieves' Landing. I think he's gonna be unfaithful to his dear wife. Why don't you head over there and see if you can advise him how best to proceed? What do you think I am? I know what you are, John. Just if you've got the time, friend. All right. Okay, bro. Turns out he's not he's not going to jump off the cliff. He in fact wants me to go do something. Hold on. Hold on. I'm working out basketball stuff. It don't even matter. We're playing Red Dead. Okay. Alright. Let me see where Thieves... I didn't... I'm not sure where Thieves Landing is, but... Ah, oh, it's right here. I thought it was a... I know you, and then... Okay. Okay, we need, um... What I was gonna say is I didn't... Didn't uh, expect to see that guy, and I like how the Stranger missions actually show you where to go. Unlike Red Dead Redemption 2, you sort of gotta wing it. I mean, sometimes what the fuck? Another one? I was I've already looted this place, bro. You were near the last time I spoke to you. You look like Uncle. I got Lombago. Talk to the man. Well, howdy. Howdy. Me, friend. Mind if I rest up at your camp a spell? Well, it'd be my pleasure. Man needs a break from this desiccated land. Thank you, mister. Mm. Say, what's that stick you got there? Oh. Y'all ain't never seen a dowsing rod before, mister? Never seen a man summon the water up from the bare earth? Uh, mister, uh... Marston. Ah. No. Can't say I have. Hmm. It's water you're looking for. What's wrong with that lake over there? Oh, there ain't nothing wrong with Lake Don Julio. Nothing wrong with it, but... Don Julio? Isn't that a alcohol, bro? Don Julio. Man needs a wellspring on his proper tie to ranch here. Makes sense. Yeah. Why, you know, just last week, I was over at Old Pleasant's house. I think I may have found something, but... <laughs> That's my friend's PC. Old coot that owns the place threatened to call the law down on me, so... People act funny around strange men with sticks. They sure do. Damn fools. Bet you he don't even know how much water's running underneath his proper tie. Why is this guy speak? Proper tie! <laughs> like Don Julio! You ain't that stupid, mister. And I can tell. I'll tell you what. Why don't you go get the old man to sell us his proper tie for a small pittance? Then I can find the source of the water, build us a proper wellspring. Maybe I will. Well, all right then. <laughs> well, all right then. What is wrong with Lake Don Julio? 
I've been told I can complete these missions whenever I see fit, so. Bro, you only... Oh, no, that's the different one. Water and honesty. All these missions, bro. All these missions got me realizing how close this guy is actually... Not this guy, but like the... This dumb whatever. Not Don Julio, but the fucking... The white side guy, or what, what the fuck is his name? It was Nigel West Dickens, okay. I was very far off with all my names. I don't know why I said the white side guy, that's just... That's gotta be racist. Can I knock these motherfuckers off? Still no killers. <laughs> Hello. Hello! Hello to you too, sir. Ah, oh, shit. Bang. With the f Come here, bitch. Is that the sheriff? I just killed them, bro. <laughs> oh, my bad, boys. Oh, well. I'm gonna take your money. Oh, okay. I'm gonna take all their money. Come here, money. Oh, shit. Who killed the horse, bro? What? Skin animal. <laughs> we just skinned the horse, mate. Pistol ammo. I needed that. I want him to Bro, I must have ADHD or something. I always get distracted. But then again, all these fucking weird quests coming out of nowhere. Like, I keep, I'm just riding along the side of the road and they're like, KILL THAT BASTARD! And I'm like, oh shit, okay. You know the funny thing was in RDRT you could just knock him over. Oh fuck! <laughs> I was not expecting that! That's... Oh no, I'm sorry! I was, I was speaking like, you will remain wanted as long as law enforcement or civilians can see you. I haven't actually become unwanted in this game. Sh fucking go, John. Go, <laughs> John, he's coming, quick. People are your kinds. You cannot help any strangers until you are out of danger. Ah. In interesting. Alright, the local sheriffs and deputies have been alerted to your trespasses and are coming to arrest you. Think again, cow polk. How do I have a $20 bouncy, bro, for running, for running a guy over that didn't even die? I actually helped originally. Ah, oh, shit. I didn't even... I don't think I pressed triangle to get off the horse. I think there's a lot less looting in... Oh. Well, hello. There's a lot less looting in this game than there is in Red Dead Redemption 2. Like, you can't... You, but I can't even inspect this place. Arthur actually writes in the journal. I think there's a camp over there, but... Let's not get distracted anymore. Let's go straight... Oh, fuck you. Yeah, try me! Try me! I said try me. I said try me. Don't you do it too, bunny. Alright, did I not kill the other one? I don't think it died straight away. Oh well. More meat to sell. Oh fuck, the horse doesn't oh, like... The horse doesn't like me cutting up stuff. And I can't calm it down either. <laughs> so look at him. I don't know if it's a him. I don't know if this, this game has horse penis. Bro. <laughs> Pause, bro, like... How do I crouch? This might be a woman. Well, we might be riding a female Bucky, which I believe was the first Bucky I ever rode. It was a- OH FUCK YOU! I don't want to kill these dogs, bro. Just calm the fuck down. Alright. 
jump over. Wait, what? This the guy ain't living here? Let's ransack the house. Hello. Oh. Oh, okay. I can't even interact with them. <laughs> so. Let's go. Oh well. I'll come back later when I can actually do stuff. I assume that place is going to become important later. It's also get becoming night time, which... I'm not a huge fan of in this game. This is the only main story mission that I have. Like, I don't have any other... Uh, on, ones. Just ones. Oh yeah, you are the merchant. Excuse Old. me. Excuse me, sir. You need help? Excuse me, sir. Mister, you alive? This isn't like a suit. Fuck. God damn it! <laughs> Bugger, fuck. Excuse me. I said, no, I'm not okay. Do I look like I'm okay? You look pretty good for a corpse. <laughs> Praise be. <laughs> Move up, Mister. Time to get you to a doctor or an undertaker. Whichever you need once we get to town. Uh, St. Peter, open up them pearly gates. I'm coming home. <laughs> Come on, mister. Come on. Hey, early. <laughs> I have a feeling I've seen this mission before. Isn't this I'm the guy that sells you tonic? You'll be fine. Just like the medicine? It. And he sells you the tonics? You better take the reins. I don't think I'm strong enough. And Dobby Diggins elixir. I'm finished. Done for. Just sit up straight, will you? What if it happened, Barry? Did you fall off the horse? I don't. Okay. Head for armadillo, friend. To draw a weapon while driving. Okay. Well, I'm gonna do it anyway. I can aim and shoot normally and still control the vehicle. God! Out of the frying pan into the fire! Excuse me! How many outlaws can a man encounter in one day? Jump! How did he know you? How did he... 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 I know who you are! We're in sure travels fast around here! They're back! I'm done for! Oh shit, there's another one. I don't know how I meant to... Alright, just follow the path, boys. Ah, oh, shit. That, how are you? Bro, you're all the way over there. Bro, that'll show you once. Are you just bleeding out now? Alright. I'm trying to, bro. Tell your horses to sharpen up. There's the motherfucker. Oh shit! Alright. <laughs> uh, how did neither of them die? Oh fuck, I don't want to kill the horse. Well, I've taken a few more than you. We're almost there. I don't know how your health is under half. I think you're bleeding out a little bit, but oh well. Shit happens. I beg you, I'm not sure I'll make it. If we don't get you to a doctor soon, you definitely won't make it. Death, I embrace you. We're here. Stay with me. Why is he holding his arm like he broke it, bro? Armadillo, we made it safe. You'll be happy to know. Thank you, sir. Thank you. You're a gentleman and a. A true man of honor. Coming from you, I doubt that means much, but I appreciate the civility. I owe you, sir. And I always pay my debts. To you now. Uh, Jesus. But if I die, I'm sorry for it. If not, I'll be your man for... for... Let's get you fixed up first. Then we'll decide what you're my man for. <laughs> I'll be your man. All right. Can we loot the wagon? If unpaid bounty on your head for earlier crimes. <laughs> oh, fine. 
I'll pay it. It's 20 bucks. 20 bucks is 20 bucks. Like, I ain't gay, but like, pause. Using a pardon letter, the telegram also clear your name without payment needed. Pardon letters can be found in locations such as some, some. I didn't see it. I'm just going to go pay the bounty. Nile Jewel's wounds will take some time to heal. While you're waiting, you can further explore New Austin. Oh, so you're wanting me to explore this shit? Absolutely fucking not. I've explored it enough in my five years on Red Dead 2. This shit, I know this shit by the back of my foreskin. What? What'd that say? I, bro, sometimes stuff flashes on my screen so quickly. Who's this guy? I'm gonna push him. <laughs> Fist of cuffs! How do you actually fight in this game? Alright. <laughs> Quick, run! Move! Move the fuck out of the way. <laughs> I need to come upstairs. Oh, what the hell is this? I'm not pet. 50 bucks. 50 bucks is 50 bucks. Easy there, lady. We're just hanging there. Nice. Alright. Oh shit, there's a gun store. Ow. <laughs> Quick, get in the gun store. What's he got? Okay. Alright, so you have... I mean, a few. Far out, why are they so expensive? I don't, what the fuck, hold on. Frickin' princes, man. I'll tell you right now. Always feasting on trees, bro. Like... Always feasting on trees. You know how much paper they need? Lots. There you go. See, that keeps printing. That did not sound good, I'll be honest. Ooh. Load paper. Bro, I did. You stupid machine. That's another thing with printers. Who's saying we meet again, bro? I'm not looking at the screen right now. I'm loading the printer with the paper. Marshal best step up post haste. Men starting to question his steel. Let me just take this one out. There's only so deep. Hey, yo, there's a... Bro, there's only so deep the paper could go in a printer. I make myself laugh. There we go. Try that. Yep, printer's definitely loaded. Hey, hey yo. Bro, I can't, I can't stop it. Just keep making it sound bad. Let's see. Uh. What is it printing, bro? Do I know? How many? Okay. <laughs> what? Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. Go on. Keep coming. How is that? 
So in the night I'm a swimmer, and right now I see that my 200 IM medley in long course, which is 50 meters pool, is quicker than my 200 medley in the short course pool. Now it's been nearly half a year since short course was even a thing, but still, I don't get it. Adam Swan, how is my 100 butterfly quick in long? Bro, okay. Alright, four bits of paper. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with them right now. Close that. Let's let's get back to buying more guns. That's good. That sentence alone is going to put me on an Australian wa watch list, bro. Cause anyway, there's an M. Is that McFarlane's Ranch? McFarlane. Every time. I'm going to do it every time. Oh, it's... Oh, no, it's not. Why did I put... Let's just run. <laughs> don't run. Don't walk, run. Oh, my horse is already here. I actually... Is that my horse? Why are you here? Right. Did you know I was going to do this mission right now? Spare the end for... It's PS5. It loads so quickly, bro. Ah, since you're here, you want to make yourself useful? Not particularly. Listen, son, I know you got a mission. Right now, I need enough gun. Why? What's happening? We've had this problem for months with this group of bandits. who are getting drunk and murdering settlers. Last night, they went to a big place up near Ridgewood. They burnt the place down, killed the men, burning most of them alive, and raped the I women. like this guy. Women both then got their throats you slit. One of them survived and walked in here this morning. Anyway. Elon, peace, brain. <laughs> no, I'm Scott. Smooth brain. All right. Thank you, John Marston. It's gonna be a bloody job. Huh. I don't think I know any other kinds, sir. There's one thing I could change about John Marston's outfit. It's the scarf. Okay, Eli, I need to drink on the job, buddy. Hey, wait up! Bro, you're the one that slowed down. Is there another? All right, boys, let's move it out. Marston, I hear you caught up with Mr. West Dickens. I did. For a man who claims to have found a remedy to all ailments, he was in pretty bad shape. His tonic has helped a great many people. It's a medical breakthrough from the East, the result of years of research. If only it could cure him of his diarrhea of the mouth. I wouldn't be so dismissive of science if I was you. Times is changing fast. He's no more a Times is changing. People can spend their hard-earned money however they please. He's certainly a character, and Wes Dickens. Wes Dickens. I can't Dickens. understand a goddamn word he's saying. A more flannel-mouthed <laughs> bunko artist I've never met. Look, vultures. We should check it out. Marston, Eli, go see what it is. Is this Eli? I thought it, uh, I thought it Eli was now. a big good guy. Oh, it is. There's just a random horse in the background. Why kill the horses? Somebody was so busy killing people they went and dropped their gun. Check category as you already you already own. Weapons. Ah. Oh, it is actually better, except for the reload speed. Okay, well, I guess we're using it. The repeater. Isn't it just called the carbine repeater in the new game? I guess we'll use this one now. Alright. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. That's, that's cool. Smooth brain. Men are born, and then they're born. At least that's how I see it. Men are born. Any number of 
couldn't have killed them in the graveyard, though. That would have been ironic. Oh, everyone's going this way. That's just plain evil. Oh, this one had a wound. Is that a dog? Or dead body. The fire still smoking. The scumbags must still be around. Come on. Come on, let's ride. The cannon got too far. Sons of bitches. Didn't you want to run a gang of outlaws, Marston? Yeah, but not like that. It wasn't our way. At least it wasn't my way. Killing and thieving's never right, boy. No matter how you dress it up. Unless it's ordered by a court of law, you mean? You know as well as I do, Marshal. One way or another, some men gotta die. The place looks deserted. Where is everyone? All right, boys. Let's have a look around. Are we getting off the horses, or are we just going upstairs with... Seen that? With that? Okay. Might as well hitch the horse, just so it doesn't go anywhere. Cause my horse is a wanderer, bro. Bucky, female Bucky is a wanderer. All right. Let's... Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. I gotta test something. Can I hiss it, or does he just shoot it? He doesn't do anything. That's probably better than. Okay. Let's check the out the outhouse. Imagine if they're all just chilling in the outhouse. No one here. Oh shit! Oh, appreciate you, Bucky. Coming in clutch for me. Oh, look at this guy. <laughs> Why do I get my horse and everyone else had to run? There's no good reason for that to be boarded up. Come on, John. Shoot that door open. Why me? How did I miss? Oh! I'm not sure I can show that on YouTube, but it's getting shown nonetheless. This is a game. A historical game. Is it, none of this is real. That's not real. This is a game. From the PS2, it's a game. It's a historical reference to a game. Western game. That's not real. I repeat. Alright. Oh, what the fuck? Where are the motherfuckers? Oh, shit. Bang. Done. Come out of the house. Come out of the house and you're dead, motherfucker. Come out of the house and you're dead, motherfucker. Why is he crouching? I don't know. Oh, fuck. There we go. Hi. Goodbye. I'm gonna need the... I'm gonna need the ammo. I'll be honest. I appreciate the ammo. I'm just looting their bodies while everyone else is fighting. Come on, Eli. Just run in. Is he dead? He is. Light him up. <laughs> My bad, I didn't notice. I didn't notice you there, bro. Sorry. I'm gonna just walk up. You and me gonna have ourselves fun. Damn him! Oh, that that is a game. It's a game that do Ted did not actually blow off. Thank you. I was convinced I was dead. That dude's head does not have a bullet hole going straight from one side to the other. Definitely not. Come on, Marshall. What are you waiting for, bitch? Hi. Right. 
fuck. Oh, okay. But don't start from the cutscene. Okay, good. <laughs> Marshall got shot. <laughs> Look at that accuracy. This doesn't have the range. Let me just. All right. <laughs> I hope you got money for a funeral. Oh, who's shooting me, bro? You dead? You're dead. Very easy. Really. All right. I need some ammo. Appreciate. Appreciate the ammo. Oh, why did I call him the horse? I don't know. Let's grab some money. Hold on, I need money. <laughs> I'm poor. I don't get paid for this unlike you guys. So. Alright, we're good now. Let's go in. Oh! Alright. Die, die! I think he's dead. I think we got him. Alright, boys. Up the stairs we go. Should I have a lesser one? <laughs> he's in this. He's in this room. Ain't you a pretty little thing? I'm gonna enjoy this. Oh shit! This <laughs> I'm gonna be all right. Head for the shed in the back as soon as it looks clear. Oh, thank God. Carry me. Adorn attire. Is that what it said? Open all. Oh. I didn't know you could open shit. Because there might be stuff in there. Oh shit, there is. This is how you search in Red Dead 1. I didn't even know that. Is that a sheriff waiting for me? Do I have a knife? Can I just knife this dude? Let me knife him. Let me knife him. I'll cut him free. Let me knife him. <laughs> John's crazy. I'm gonna run in there with a knife. Wait, no. That's the host. This is the hostage one. We don't want to do that shit. Don't worry, Sheriff. Bro, what? His gun was deflecting the bullets, bro. <laughs> oh, we gotta do it again. Let's run it back. Spare the rod. Spill the, spill the beans. That is not my weapon of choice. Yes, that's correct. <laughs> they played the sound! Where is that guy going? There we go. Oh, yeah. Alright, now I actually do need the... Oh. There's a guy right across from me. <laughs> there we go. Alright, once again we're here. Making money. Making moves, looting bodies, because once again we're poor, so give me some, give me a little bit. Let's go, alright. Did he die? I shot him once. Oh shit, no, he didn't. He's just injured. Oh, light the fucker up! Alright. Oh, light him up! Make sure he's dead. This is not excessive force. This is just... Alright. Okay. This is shit's annoying, bro. You and me gonna have ourselves some fun. Oh my god. As soon as you can make a run for the shed. I just shut Get his brain dead. out, bro. Thank you. I was convinced I was dead. Let's loot him. That's gotta be one of the craziest kills I've ever seen on this game. Can I just let the sheriff deal with this shit? Take a break for the 
shed when the cops Oh, I got him. There'll be a deputy waiting for you. Thank you. They said they were gonna kill us all. I swear to I just laid it in. Like that's all of them. Let's see how the hostages are doing. Pray. Damn you. <laughs> I'm gonna keep the gun out just in case. I don't I don't trust it. I don't trust the hostages, they were in the house as well. Yeah, exactly. This is what I think. Some mob tried to escape into the south, but then some robber started chasing him down like wild dogs. I thought you were supposed to protect us. You look shore. like a wild dog. No, nah, that's wild, very my bad. Nothing. You're some man on a government payroll taking money that the rest of us have to pay for with our lives. Yeah. What is wrong with you? Yeah. Shut the fuck. Not up, man. The man that kills the boss of that bunch gets fifty dollars. It ain't about the money, Marshall. These are people's lives. People's homes. Bray, he can't protect everyone. Apparently, he had five different jobs across the county. Oh, get away. oh fuck. Okay. Right, Fucking fine. Are oh, you bitch? You want the fifty dollars? I want the fifty dollars. Give me the fifty dollars. Here we go. No, no. Not big one. This might be our chance. Uh, John wants my wants Ben dead. I don't know. You talking about? If this is how you treat your family, I'd hate to see what you do to your enemies. That was a lifetime ago. And bearing in mind, he's left me for dead the last two times I've seen him. I'm about to figure him. Is that somebody on the cliff? About to figure him. You just walk away. Oh, it is Bill. I didn't kill you before, but I sure as shit will now. Get yourself down here, Bill. You know you ain't man enough to stop me. You know I don't want to kill you, but I will. You always did have a high opinion of yourself, John. <laughs> Dutch always said you were an arrogant son of a bitch. I guess he was about right. Get him, boys! I, why did I imagine him say, Get him, little boys! Like that, exactly like that, bro. Oh shit, I've already been out here. <laughs> I didn't know this was where it was going to take. Go down. Aim assist, help me. Aim assist, help. <laughs> we ain't never gonna be friends now. He took him down Who's this? Come on, Bessie. Get in. Get in. Oh. Norman Deke. I guess we're taking him in. I nice see you again, buddy. Thanks for your help, John. Norman here is going to help us get to Bill. Thank you, Norman. Thank you, Mr. Deke. Mighty kind. <laughs> Fuck you. Hog time. Let's get him to jail. That's the third F word I've heard in this game. Oh, I got, I got a bit of money. I'm making bank. Fame. Honorable things. Who's B again? Oh, I don't want to go to. 
It's it's such a ride. It's actually not that far. The game makes it look like it's ages, but it's really not. If you follow the train tracks, you'll get there in no time. Shit. But before we do that, obviously, you gotta... Gotta loose a few people. Get off the horse. Alright. Oh shit, my bad. I thought you were a person. Sorry about that horse. I, I wasn't the one... I wasn't the one that shot you, but... You know, I think there's someone under him. Huh? Why are we skimming the horse? I didn't know. You can't do that. <laughs> they can't do that in the RDR2. That's for sure. Oh uh, well, there's a skinned horse for you. What have we seen? Uh, a few, few, um, few stranger, stranger things tonight. That are not real. I repeat, not real. I had to speak over the cutscene almost the entire time because it's not real. And I don't want to get booted off for a game that's, what, 14 years old this year? And it's not real. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Don't want to get booted off of YouTube. That'd be. Oh shit, a train. Head on! I don't think that was the best idea, but maybe it'll get me back to McFarland's ranch, because that's where I keep respawning. Oh, would you look at that? Oh, and the horse is fine too, let's go! Let's do it. The burning. Excuse me, Mr. Marston! He went out this morning to ride the land. <laughs> nah. He was supposed to be back hours ago. Oh. I don't know. The ranch hands have been out looking, but so far they found nothing. Well, come on, let's go look for him. Uh, of course. Let's see if we can find the old goat. Well, maybe that's not the kindest thing to say to him. Come in, Bond. I'm feeling about this. Not like him to be away for so long. Don't worry, we'll find him. He's not as young as he used to be. What if he's hurt himself? Your father can still handle himself just fine, Miss McFarland. You feel like an oak. <laughs> You're probably right, but I can't help worrying. He's all I've got. The um graphics in this game remind yeah, me much more of like a picture Ms. book. Ford. Like almost they've been drawn. The five of them died. Like Either really well. Whereas, whereas the um. Graphics in the second game are like a movie. You know, it's, it's different. He should be here helping you and your pa. I don't want his help. He can live his life any way he wants. But when I see those city fellers coming in on the railway, all dressed up like a sore toe, I fear a little for his soul. He switched his saddle for a tie, and that's fine. I just never met a man in a tie I could trust. Who's that over there? Where? I don't know. Where are you looking? You said, who's that over there? And you'd just bring up, bring us like 50 meters. Nothing nice. Wrestlers, I guess. Maybe the baller twins, that bunch. Now you head back to the ranch right now. Fetch the wagon. Yes, sir. Marson, you watch after her. I'll do that, sir. Please stay close. Hey! <laughs> I think we should get back there as soon as we can. Who could have done something like that? Your boss seemed to have an idea who it was. Let's just do what he says and get the wagon. I keep trying to get the gun out in preparation because I know she's about to go down. Like that's how this game usually is. I've got a good mind to head over to Pike's face and myself. I don't think that's a good idea. <laughs> and you're no better. How many men have you killed? Do you really want to know? It's disgusting. You never met the men I killed. I heard the way you talk about that gang you were in. Like there was some twisted morality to what you did? We all have a code. Only some of us don't realize The outlaw with the code? How wonderfully romantic. Why is she the hate me now? Murderer, the noble criminal. There's nothing more depressing than a man who's found a way to think the bad into good. Look, Mr. Marston, the barn is on fire. I don't give a fuck now. You just insulted me. Doors are blocked. We need to find another way in. Help me, will you? 
Help me, will you? Oh, you fucking... You just insulted me and now you expect me to help your fucking barn? Fine. <laughs> Come on, John. Mr. Morris. Oh shit, I gotta get up there. Okay. I'm just walking, bro. Calm down, calm down. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Climb it! Oh wait, shit. Oh, you couldn't do this in RDR2. Okay. Alright. It's like Hitman. I toyed with the idea of changing my YouTube logo. That's why it was like a baby looking thing from a 2k game a little bit ago but it's um yeah no i i like him in so come on why is this here oh because it was fabulously set on fire daniel it was fabulously set on fire you stupid bit. There's no way. I was in this for so much longer. I've been... <sighs> Come on. I couldn't save the other one. Oh, shit. Oh, wait. Okay. We saved the horses. Go and look for Bonnie by the pen. Ah, oh, do I have to ride the horse? Oh no. She died by, from smoke inhalation. Even though it was literally just the doors opening. This is great looking for Bonnie here, John. You sure know how to handle yourself. Thanks, Martin. Yes, John, thanks. You, well, you saved the ranch. If you'll excuse me, I, I've got chores to attend to. They're just gonna let it burn because there's not much else they can do. It's just get, it's a wildfire. Did all I could, Miss McFarland. Sorry about all the damage. Man <sighs> seems to really want you out of here. Yeah, well, my father fought Indians. I scarcely think we're gonna be frightened by some white trash. White trash can be pretty frightening. Well, they don't frighten me. Good. John, my family owes you. A great debt. I think you got enough debt. You saved my life. All I ask of you is this. If I get back home and get my farm started back up, you'll sell me some cattle. I prefer doing business with people I know. Of course, Mr. Marston. It'd be my pleasure. Be my pleasure. Um, well, you get some rest. I've got to go see how my father's buried up. <laughs> His face looks so weird. <laughs> John's face. Why are you sleeping here? You literally have a house, bro. Oh, he's not. Alright. I say we save the game real quick and have a snooze. That must have been one of the biggest complaints of this original game was not being able to pet the dog. Let's save the game. Oh, we can we can overwrite the safe slot. It doesn't matter. Oh, every time, every time, I'm gonna, I'm not. Oh, I like the Marshall Mitchell. Marshall, I like the Marshall Mitchells. I like the Marshall Mitchells. Yeah. Marshall Mitchells are fine. F bro, the Ma Marshall Missions, I like those ones. Those ones are good. That's why we're doing more. Can I get a ride into Armadillo? Hey, are you talking to me? I'm the chicken headed guy? Your face looks like a mush potato. You a tough guy, mister? I hope so. We gonna have a showdown. Don't worry, I'll close your eyes before any ladies see you. 
approach the. You don't know me, Messer. Approach the X to start the duel. Okay. Tobias, <laughs> Tobias World. You've accepted the duel, the tutorial. Well, nah, I need the tutorial. I don't know how to duel, bro. Draw your, to draw your gun, use L2, alternatively pull back on that. Shoot him in the face! Shot accurately is determined by this. Okay, alright, I didn't mean to kill the fucker, but... How is that in any way assisting town smoke? <laughs> I did a duel with him. My bad, bro. I didn't mean to kill you, but like, you, you wanted that in the first place. So like, don't blame it on me. Ride shotgun. I can steal, <laughs> I can steal the wagon. There's no one here. I was just trying to get... Can I buy a train ticket? Hold on, I gotta... I'm learning about this game. I'm learning about the game. I gotta see if I can buy a train ticket. After I just <laughs> killed a man. Right. Fuck out of here. Can I buy a ticket? How do I... How, what the... <laughs> Why have you come in here just punching me, bro? What? <laughs> yeah, run away. I'm not gonna shoot him because as soon as I shoot somebody, I get the police on my dick, bro. They, like, need to come up for breath sometimes, but, like, they don't do it very often. That's all I'm saying. Pike's base gang hideout should generally count contain hostile criminals. Oh shit, it's down there. Well, I would do it if I could be bothered doing it, and I'm not bothered doing a Pike's hideout. That's what it's called. Wait, no, it's called Pike's base. The one that Bonnie talked about. But. You know what, it doesn't matter what it's called because I ain't doing that shit. Come on. Come on. Yeah, I thought you were gonna call me over. Fifteen bucks? Go! Go! Might as well. <laughs> okay. Okay, you can pick that one now. Quick. Over here. Over here. Quick! John's animation is so funny. Quick! Oh shit, he's got. I need this 15 bucks. I need this 15 bucks more than I need to breathe. Where is he? Oh, he's over there. He's only just picked up his second one. Easy. Should I wait for him to get back? <laughs> Here he comes. Look at him. You're good, friend. You win. I thought you were the expert. All right. Cheers for the fifteen. Cheers for the fifteener or whatever. <laughs> Cheers for the tenner. Smackaroos. You know, there's not a lot of collision in this game. That's for sure. Like, I can just... One thing I do like about RDR2 is that you can run into anything and <laughs> fall off your horse. That's not so much... That's not so much the same in this game, but you know what? It's fine. It's fine. 
So like for instance, there's these guys on horses. In Red Dead Redemption 2, especially if you have a war horse, you'd be able to run up, run behind their horse and knock him off. Or like, like T-bone them. Or like this. So that would have knocked us both off. But, oh, see, here's a good example. <laughs> like, bro, I just moved him out of the way. I didn't even, didn't even fall down. That bird doesn't look like it's moving. <laughs> it is, it is. I'm just moving faster, that's why. Let's do this mission. How are we doing today? Can I lead the horse? <laughs> Alright. Stay here, Bucky. We're going in. Hanging Bonnie Mc... Did that say Hanging bon Bonnie McFarlane? I did Fuck. Who? Who? My daughter, you fucking scum! Where's Bonnie? I don't know. I haven't seen her since after the fire. Why? Why? I just got here. Since yesterday afternoon. You know, I don't think I can cope. If I lose another child. Now, Drew, nobody's lost anything yet. I'm sure she's fine. Oh, Mr. Oh, that's... Marshall! Who the hell? Marshall! Come out, come out, wherever you are! Who the hell's that? Even better. Who's that? Good day, Mr. McFarlane. Get down from that horse, boy, or I'll shoot. <laughs> I Who's this guy? That, mister. Not if Drew McFarlane wants to see his bony back in one piece. Hey, Mr. McFarlane. This is a nice girl. You how'd they, how'd they get, get it? There. You know, part of me's got the thinking I should just marry her myself. Why is he breathing Girl, so heavy? That. What do you want? That's better. Oh yeah. Yo. Yo, his boy. You get your daughter back, mister. Yo, Bill Williamson's do boy. Outlaws, boy. Yeah, you do. Let's not waste each other's time pretending otherwise. Whole government themselves ain't much more than a bunch of crooks. This is the land of opportunity, mister. That's what it's called the in the RDR2 online deals. Before 15 friends of mine take out all their anger. Where the hell is she? Where is she, boy? Ring Deke up the tumbleweed for hours. And don't get no funny ideas, or I will slit that horse throat myself. You boys have a pleasant afternoon. Yeah. I don't know why do. Drew thought do John did stage. something. You and me, Marshal. Mr. McFarland, I'll get you your daughter back. I owe her that. Please do. Why does everyone need to be so well dressed, bro? Like, why does he need to wear a suit, button-up shirt, blazer? Keep him mug tied. Quick as you can, deputy. Make sure he's tied on good. Stay with me, Marston. I won't let anything happen to her, sir. I'll try not to let anything right, happen to her. Get this McFarlane back. See, this is what happens when the Federals interfere in our affair. Are you happy now? No, I ain't happy at all. And I already told you, I ain't with the government. Now you say that, John, but the only thing I know for sure is who sent you. They made me come here. They gave me no choice. That's your federal government, Mr. Johnson. They come down here dressed as cocky as the King of Diamonds, talking a lot of flannel about helping us, about spreading peace and civilization to the West, but they brought nothing but trouble and taxes. But they bought none. Wolves and shoot clothing, all of them. Rob you, then make you pay to have someone investigate the crime on your behalf. People around <laughs> here have been fooled into feeling protected when they're worse off than they were before. Fellas I know don't care about people. All they care about is lying in their pockets. Well, yeah. That well, might or may not be me. So important to them. Norman D. Williamson, right hand man. In other words, a glorified errand boy. Wait, Marshal. I'll be back for you. Bill Standards have slipped. <laughs> I don't even. Who was. Kind of man who's mean enough to be second in command, but 
too cowardly and stupid to ever be a leader. Don't ever use that line near your deputies. You know, for his sake, they'd best not have laid a finger on Miss McFarland. So, what is this place we're headed? Double hope we don't have to see. Some people say it's haunted. It was quite a town back in its day. Then they built the railroad to Armadillo and went clean past Tumbleweed. And that was that. Pretty soon, everybody had up and left. Now it's just thieves, smugglers, and bandits. It's Tumble like here. Oh, popular spot for lynching. There's. Too. Let's try to avoid that if we can, Mark. There's literally no reason to go to Tumbleweed in Red Dead Redemption 2. I don't even think there's a mission there. It's just weird. But I don't know why jo John is asking about Tumbleweed. It's not like he's never been there. Oh wait, because cause this is the first game. I keep thinking this game came afterwards for some reason. I don't know why. But chronologically it does, but like... We play the order the games come out, then no. Didn't? It was either John or Arthur that said he originally wanted to be a lawman. That's madness. Rules are made to be broken. That's almost definitely on a t shirt. Bro, Gap Tooth Ridge. I do not like this ride to Tumbleweed. It's there's no point to it. Can we have taken a wagon? Yeah, okay. I know where Tumbleweed is. Look back about nearly three years ago. I ran all the way from Tumbleweed to Saint Denis, so I recognise this bridge. Yeah. I did it as John as well. Did it in one hour. Actually, I had to, it was meant to be unedited footage of me just running, but I had to cut like ten minutes down of me just doing some random shit at the end. John, literally just me making it to the border of Saint Denis. Of then it cuts off. Keep your eyes open. I sincerely doubt these scum plan to play fair. Fair my ass. You bet. Besides, Norm here is going to be my shield, ain't you, Norm? <laughs> be my pleasure. <laughs> be my into town. We'll be right behind you. All right, sunshine. Let's move. All right, I'm moving. I'm going to just point sure, it. It's been nice for the boys to have a four to play with. I hear those rancher girls like it. Should I just shoot him and see what happens? Maybe she won't want to go home. So good. Come on now, boys. Cut me loose. <laughs> I, bro, let the intrusive thoughts win. Can I shoot him in the leg? Alright. Sure, it's been nice for the boys to have a whore to play with. You want me to shoot you, friend? I'm walking, goddammit. I hear those rancher girls like it in the rear. Damn. Maybe she won't want to go home. She's been fucked so good. Oh my god. What are you waiting for? Untie me, fillers. Wait, where's Bonnie? I'm coming! I'm running! I'm gonna kill these more folks. What? Oh shit! I'm coming, I'm fucking coming, I'm running! I 
Oh, what the fuck am I meant to do? Hurry up, jump. Oh, fire out. How do we die? Well, okay. Alright, alright. We're Bonnie. I thought we had a deal. Well. Just keep moving. Just keep running. <laughs> Evasive maneuvers. Oh, okay. Oh, fuck. Literally. <laughs> Get it? That's not funny. I'm trying, I'm trying. I don't have the... Quick, get over before she dies of hanging! Can I aim at the rope? Fight. There we go, I got her, I got her, I got her. Bo oh my days. I'm- no, fuck you. Okay, I'm assuming that I'm just going to get left here. <laughs> How'd they even get her? Bonnie, are you okay? I'm fine now, Mr. Marston. Thank you. Thank you. Far out. Well, it took you so long, you stupid man. Well, you weren't exactly helping me. If you think I'm gonna lower myself by making a joke about being all tied up, you got another thing coming. Come on. <coughs> I gotta know. I gotta know. Did that? No, nah, bro. That's wild. My fault. My fault. <laughs> See, I told you they're gonna leave me out here. This shit hole. Bro, it's even worse than RDR two. Bro, I'm pretty sure there's still a saloon here, ain't there? And yeah, there is. Look, see, that's that's an actual open saloon in Red Dead Redemption 2. But it's because this place got abandoned, because the train line got put in. That's what he said. So I have to make my way. You think I can run in here? Oh, it's open. Yeah, this looks similar. I had a lot of good battles in this town, in Red Dead Online. I'll be honest. Where's the blackjack room? This is it. Right here. What's in there? What'd I get? I didn't get shit. I did not get shit. Come on, horse, we need to get the hell out of here. Who's this? Yeah, there's a gun store and stuff. Alright. I did actually press the touchpad before I pressed the um, options button, so I'm still doing that. Oh, yeah. Me and my, me and my friend kept riding the horse into the wall, but it kept somehow jumping over. So, alright, let's get back to this Winston Churchill guy, or whatever his name is, Norm Dickens or something like that, Wes Dickens, I don't know. This seems like a more direct route to where I'm going. Isn't, whatchamacallit, just over this hill, tumbleweed, not tumbleweed, armadillo. Armadillo. It's just over this hill. So why did it take the sheriff and I? <laughs> why did it take the sheriff and I so long? Oh, this ain't it. Never mind. This is, this is original. This is original dead farm. Horse breaking jobs are now available. I don't really want to break any more horses. That's just annoying. Why do I have a house here? Oh, I can rent.
How did my honor go down, though? You, they needed to be taught a lesson. Don't oh. push me now. Oh shit! I I killed a civilian. My bad. That's how my that's how my honor went down. I saved one of the civilians, so my honor went back up. But I killed one of them. So I think it was the guy at the front, wasn't it? No, it wouldn't have been. It would have been one of the dudes at the back. Oh well. Some people have to die. That's all I'm gonna say. Rent five bucks. I guess it's the shed, isn't it? Oh shit, that's not my horse. My bad. Where are you? Let's get back to um, Armadillo. Never thought I'd say that. I guess because the reason they made this one like so western is because really it's it was the original western game like they had red dead revolver oh shit i missed i nearly missed that shit all right they had red dead revolver but they uh Dehydrated or something? Have I seen you before? Oh, uh, yes, I think so. On the train from Blackwater. Right? Oh, that was you. Yeah. I remember that. Yeah, you were talking with the preacher. Yeah, yes, I, uh... I was. I don't know if it's so safe out here, Miss. Oh, uh, Jenny. You can call me Jenny. Uh, uh, all right. Uh, I'm safe because I, I have faith. So, uh, Faith can move mountains. That's the whole point. You're trying to move a mountain? Oh, <laughs> no. I, I can't do anything. But with Faith... You trying to move a mountain? You stupid fuck? I can achieve great things. I know that. I know it. Yep. You want me to take you back into town, ma'am? You seem kind of unwell. I say one and only. Clarity out here. I'm him. I see things pure. You are not him. The world is so beautiful. She's definitely high. I just realized that. That'll kill you. She's definitely high, bro. illness. Nothing's gonna kill me, sir. Well, take care then. She she has to be high, bro. <laughs> Help Jenny by bringing her medicine. Do I have medicine? How much? Oh yeah, I haven't used my own medicine, so I can just give her that one. Miss Jenny. I've I've never used my own medicine, so I just give her. Don't some. look like the Almighty's much inclined to help you out here. I was kind of worried about you, so I brought you some medicine. Oh, oh heavens! Oh praise you, Lord! I knew you'd save me. Excuse me. You see. It was only through his will that you were ordered to save me. Tell me, <coughs> were there angels in your vision? Jenny, uh, can I take you back into town? I'm going to town anyway. So. Savior, I knew you'd save me. <coughs> Just drink the medicine. God damn. Oh, I'm fine here, mister. I'm in heaven. <coughs> Is she dying? Jen Jenny, are you gonna die? I got... Okay, I got a trophy for that. Complete, complete a task for a stranger. Jenny's faith complete. Can I at least get my medicine back? No, you know what's gonna happen now? I'm probably gonna see her in town when I get back. Because I'm going there now. Lucky for me, I hadn't used my medicine yet, so... Uh, that's cool. Let's go. I gotta I gotta buy some more. I don't even use it, but I do. I gotta buy more. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. 
I'm gonna be honest, Arm Armadillo is a little further from Tumbleweed than I thought. Which is what exactly why no one lives in Tumbleweed anymore. What the hell? Let's see how fast this thing can really go. Anyway, I was talking about why this game was so out west. It's because this was like the original western game other than Red Red Dead Revolver. So I'm assuming old edition newspapers for sale you can purchase. Where? Where? And why is that room fifty dollars? Sort of just. Oh shit, she gave me five bucks. Don't think you'll be wanting this no more, friend. I didn't mean to kill <laughs> I'll be honest, I didn't mean to kill him. But I was like, ugh. Might have shot him a bit low there. I don't know how my honor went up fifty from that. I think the mission was started if I if I'm this far away from it. Because I'm just trying to get Oh here's the dude. <laughs> He's in here. Did I have a bullet in my leg? Any meds, laudanum, adrenaline, or pills, come see me. So, wait, am I selling shit? Oh, fuck, did I sell that shit? No, this is... I'm selling some good ah, okay, no, I bought that. Might as well just sell you your... <laughs> you have any night fevers, come back and see me. Oh, there you go. You can have my wolf pelts and my wolf hearts. <laughs> wolf hearts are worth like one dollar, aren't they? In Red Dead 2. There you go, so. Coyote pelt. There you go. I'll keep the coyote. I'll keep the coyote meat. But the buck skin, you can not have all that. And the buck antlers, I guess. I'll keep the flowers. Alright. That's what I've got for sale. These wanted posters are beginning to be bounty hunting. You shall not give false testimony except for profit. And I can tell you with no uncertainty that miracle cures are no laughing matter. Don't we? Isn't this the dude that's ringing the bell in Red Dead 2 when you go to Tumbleweed? No, when you come to Armadillo? Well, he's like, he's, he's the one that rings the bell. He's like, read all about it. Claria. And then he's like, I sell this tonic, that's why I'm not sick. I'm pretty sure that's, this is the guy. At my service. At everyone's service. At the service of science. Of knowledge. Of life. How are your wounds? Oh, oh, much, much better. But then, they would be. Would be... I know a cure for all ailments, Mr. Marston. Ah, I'm sure you do. And I'm sure for just two dollars an ounce, I could live forever. Oh, but for you, sir, I'd do a bulk discount rate of $1.95 an ounce. <laughs> as long as you buy 100 ounces or more, that's a lot of immortality. Ah, uh, give it up, old man. That's Mr. West Dickens to you, boy. Boy! Give it up, old man. Listen, Marston, I'm broke, but this stuff is good. It works. I need a healthy young man like you. <laughs> Come along, and let's ride over to my first customer at Ridgewood, and I'll I'm explain broke. while we go. Are you going to force me to ride, drive it again? As long as there's no people that I need to shoot in this one. There are people there in dire need of my tonic. Oh, finally. Alright. Bridgewood Farm. 
John Marston. Good week in the week. Noble out of their hard-earned money. Get back on the road! We'll have nothing left by the time we get to Ridgewood. My dear boy, it is you who is gullible, if I may be so bold, for <laughs> eating such ill-informed scuttle. You're as full of wind as a horse with the collar. I have been blessed with the gift of language, and for that I will not apologize. But the West Dickens elixir speaks themselves. My thousands of happy customers attest to that. You're broke, aren't you? Didn't look so happy. If my tonic is such a sham, how do you explain the fine battle in which you find me? Last time you saw me, I was knocking at death's door. You should thank the doctor for that. I reckon you were acting it up worse than it was. Act I can, John. More convincing old fellow there has never been. And so shall you be fair. Yeah. Hold on. Why? Why did I think to do this? I just wanted to see my game completion. 15.1% is actually pretty crazy. It's not. It's, I don't think it's anywhere near as long as the second game. Ah, product. Oh, am I going to shoot a guy in the leg? I will have you perform a few feats of wonder to amaze and impress the pig. Such as? Oh, nothing out of the ordinary for a man in your line of work, I assure you. So oh, do you have the dead eye, Tom? No, no, just you the dead eye. Let me see. Enterprise, that's all. Do you think that buxom young girl you see on the Boyette camera posters knows the first thing about photography? Advertising. I'm going to just wait for him future. to finish. You'd best be a man of your word. Come on, we must not delay. Onward to Ridgewood. Best you alight here, dear boy, so no one sees us arriving together. I'll see you there. Be ready to enchant the crowd. <laughs> Do I have to walk? I assume not, right. Oh shit, it's not even that far away. I'll bring the horse. Come on, Bucky. Yeah. <laughs> I saw that wagon just despawn, bro. How's there gonna be a crowd here? Oh shit, there is actually a crowd forming. That's kind of wild. Let's hit you here, Bucky. You wait here while I go scam. Scam and get scammed, bro. Scam this guy out of his broke ass money, bro. Friends, hardworking souls. Ah, oh, it's Snake. Yeah, it's it's Dead Eye Tonic. Do you suffer from rheumatism, lumbago, chronic sciatic? Uh, uh, Neurologic or inflammatory pain? Well, I represent the only company that makes the genuine article that cures headaches, neuralgia, uh, earache, toothaches, backaches, swelling, sprains, sore chests, swelling of the throats, contracted cords and muscles, anxieties and ravaged nerves, stiff a professional yet dislocations, cuts and bruises, and it adds vitality and vigor to the healthy man. I'm guessing it's the um, overall tonics, like, like it's the one that peels everything. Imagine if it gives you a choice. You sir, come up here, step right up. It would have been funny if it gave you a choice and you just said no. That's the spirit, ladies and gentlemen. Pay close attention. This poor wretched volunteer, entirely unknown to me. We'll demonstrate the effects of Dr. West Dickens' own patent tonic. 
Be you a cowpoke or athlete, this miraculous elixir developed with the wisdom of the East keeps the muscles supple and relaxes the cords. It loosens the joints and gives a feeling of youth and vigor to the whole system. Not possible, I hear you say. Well, not possible. Faith can move mountains, but I ask not for faith. I am a faith can science. move mountains. He just said it. Science will be vindicated. Your eyesight is greatly improved, is that not so, friend? If you say so. That's right, it is. You heard him. What a good sport you are, sir. Now, gaze over yonder at that porch. If you squint, you may just be able to make out the skull that's hanging there. Oh, right, there it is. Friend, shoot that skull and demonstrate the miraculous eyesight you now possess. Eagle, granted by okay. Dr. West Dickens' own patent tonic. Anybody can make that shot. This man is a fraud. If your eyes so damn sharp, why don't you try shooting my hat out of the air? My friends, our test case has been challenged to okay. shoot a gentleman's hat out of the sky above our heads. You can fool me, but you ain't fooling me. Right. Let's just see how sharp you should I shoot him in the head instead? <laughs> Here it comes. Shoot the man's hat from the sky after it is thrown. I thought we were here to see. Have you ever seen there we go. I forgot you could hold the power of the elixir. Look out of the sky. Hey! Hey! What? You think you can put a hole in a man's hat? Walk away, do you? Am I finally going to be able to fight? Come on, are you a man or not? A challenge of battle has been offered to our volunteer. Look at him, the tonic is coursing through his veins. Oh, finally, it's allowing me to punch. Let's go. I'm prompted. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, you gotta lock on. That's how you do it. There it is. <laughs> what, bro? This is like a hype crew. Do not let this opportunity pass you by. You got over there. Go get this. Watch out! He's got a gun. Who the hell do you think you are? You ain't leaving here alive. Oh no. The kind of deadly accuracy I actually aimed for his head. Come, I have plenty for all. Get out of my way. No harm in trying one bottle, I suppose. Well, I think that I like that mission. That was good. I like that. I'm just glad that my normal job involves either chasing after cattle or murderers. Not the likes of you, mister. Don't be like that. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'd like to say my goodbyes, head on back to the real world. Uh, 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 wait, sir. I, I've been thinking about your predicament, and uh, I think I may have an idea. I've been thinking I could be your cunning Odysseus. Beware of the Greeks bearing what? gifts, sir. Mm -hmm. What's this? Make them into Trojans. I don't rightly get you. I want you to go and see my old friend Seth. Uh, he can come across as a little curious, but I'm sure you two will get on. I'm uh, sure. He's uh, most often found at Coots Chapel. He's very devout. Why see him? Because between him and me, we can get those gates to open for you, and you can walk right in, just like in Homer's great Trojan yarn! Yeah. Do I know where this friend lives? Ah, oh, yep, there you go. Meet Seth in Coots Chapel. There we go. Hold it right there! There's no way that.
Let's let's ride. Get the fuck out of here. Oh yeah, you're right. I can't. I can't. I can't. I have no idea. I didn't. That guy was so. He, he was like, I guess there's no way out of this. Oh well. Why is that circle following me so hard? Bro, what? Oh my gosh. They're on my tail. They do be on my tail though. Quick. Bro, why is the ones going down so slow? Hurry the fuck up! A posse is located, do you? Oh, it was a posse. It was a posse. Okay. I guess we'll go see Seth. Because I planned... I didn't actually think... The mission where you go take out Bill would be this... This long... Like, would be so far away. Because I guess it's still... I was trying to fight... I was trying to fight him. Like, get used to the controls. But... Someone with your gun or knife, you can rob them. Take in any cash. I was letting me interact with people. Follow the stranger. Where are we going, bro? Please don't take me. Okay. Hey, mister. They're about to aim my buddy and he ain't done nothing wrong. Bro, he's taking me through the fields. I might get my gun out just in case he tries to shoot. Oh, shit. You're, you're a bad guy. You're a bad guy. Bad guy, of course I'm gonna end you, bro. <laughs> what is going on? What is he doing? He's, he's trying to start the horse and the horse don't want to start, bro. I'm making bank, bro. I nearly got a grand. <laughs> Just like me, for real. I guess we're skinning the horse. Get some of that lean horse meat. That, okay. Uh, that can be taken out of context, I guess. Is that my horse? Are you my horse? No, you're. This is my horse. You're my horse. Come here, my horse. Let's go. My guy. How you doing, my guy? Don't my guy. This guy, my guy. Where's the town? Oh, there you are. <laughs> but we're not going to the town, are we? We're going to a chapel. That's like a kilometer away from the town. It's dead straight. Is it that place on top of the hill? Don't my guy, this guy, my guy. Mani oh, you thought I was going to say it. Is this dude just out in the bush? Wait, my horse finally has max stamina. Oh, let's go. Unless this is my horse. I think it is, but... Yeah, this dude's just out in the wild. They're going to hang my buddy. My buddy, but he ain't done no wrong. Oh, shit, a stranger. Let me just go say hello to this man. Oh, there's a lady. This is a lady. You sound old. <laughs> What's the... Everything all right, oh, madam? no. It's Miss... Oh. Oh, let me look at you. My gentleman caller. You remind me of my Peter. Have you seen him? I've not I seen so. Peter. Where is that man? We'll be late for the ceremony. He must still be at the saloon in Armadillo, talking to the musicians. He's such a fine man. This one's so close. That's bad. The town. Right for me, as usual. Well, I gotta get going, ma'am. I'm sure your Peter will be just fine. Wait, I beg you. 
Would you possibly go fetch him for me? This was meant to be my perfect day. Please, sir. Something must have happened. I can't bear it. It's probably hooking up in a in a room. So you want me to go find your Peter so you can have a perfect day? Yes. Please. <laughs> you want me? I'll see what I can do. Oh. Alright. Now I was about to start a mission, but I guess Okay, fine. But I was about to go do this mission, but this Armadillo is so close, it's like right here, so I was like, what the heck? And I know where the musicians are, so this is the dude on the piano. This is Armadillo, right? Yeah, there you go. Strong in the team here. Oh yeah, it's it's a person. Nice. Okay. All right. Oh, far out. I just moved him, bro. <laughs> just so you know, I don't take requests, Mister. I'm looking Are you for other? a man. Name's Peter. Fellow's meant to get married today. See Are you sure he's meant to get married? Who? Peter. What she said. You ain't after no Pete Turner, are you? Right. Oh, I know. Where can I find him? Well, my memory escapes me when not properly stimulated. And let's see if we can refresh it. Five dollars will do. Or you could run a little later. I'm not. For me. No. What do you need done? It's my wife. Oh. She packed her things this morning and left me. Right. The dumb wench is still at the freight station waiting for the stagecoach. Right, is that... If you could... convince her to take me back. Do I get a choice here? Because I'll just pay you five bucks. Her name's Rose. I guess I'll go have a talk with her. Now, you'll need more than talk with that bitch. Why are you talking to... If his wife's close, I'll try and convince her, but if she's not, then I'll... Are you the wife? Excuse me, miss? Er... Uh, Rose? If that useless, whore-mongering bastard sent you, get lost! Miss, please. If only... You know what? Tell that bastard I ain't going back. Not this time. Not even at gunpoint. Sign an oath, miss. For better or worse. The way I see it, you should give him one last chance. Stop bothering me, you dumb cowpoke, or I'll call the marshal. Hogtie or threaten Rose? Really? Well, you sure ain't no gentleman, are you? Sure, I'll go back to him, but trust me, same as God. Kill him when he's asleep. Okay. Good business, madam, and I wish you luck with it. Too yellow to come and get me himself, Izzy. I'll poison I just pointed a gun at him. What did he do? What didn't he do? He's a fiddler who can't stop fiddling. Oh, there's a different musician on now. There you go. You're welcome. Truth is, Pete Turner ain't been an armadillo for near on 20 years now. Kind of a queer fella and all. Wasn't here every night, sure as the moon in the sky. Ah, oh, so you're telling me she's crazy. What happened to him? Well, what happens to all of us? We die. I reckon you'll find him at Odd Fellows Rest. Yeah, that's where he. I lost a hundred on her, but you know what? We'll get that back in a day, bro. Find Peter Odd Fellows Rest. Now where? The darn doggity fog is odd fellas rest. Is this it? No. Are you? I don't. I guess this. No, man. 
Fine, I'll, I'll finish the mission. I ain't happy about it, but I'll do it. I could have hogtied her, but the honor would have been the same, man. I might have had the police called. The police... I don't think I got the honor from that, but that's so good. I got the ammo, and that's, that's just as good. I accidentally knocked him over, so <laughs> he started running away. I mean, that's kind of my bad, but... I'm guessing it's the graveyard that we've passed three times. Three or four times. There we go. I was not expecting to get lost in a stranger's mission, I'll be honest. Str I, like, I like doing the stranger's missions, but ever since the first one had me get thumped by a boar, I am with it. Yeah, see, there's the cemetery. Like I thought it was going to be. You wait there, Bucky. Maybe it's the anniversary or something, I don't know. Hewitt? Peter Turner. Miss. Killed by a blow in the head. Oh. He will never dance with another. Oh shit, am I done now? <sighs> okay. Alright, well, that one's done. Let's talk to Seth, I guess. Let's go. Bro, you could have figured that out. Truth is, that man ain't been in here for 20 years now. I got all the honor back from <laughs> putting in the gun at the wife. And then John was like, oh, well, it's your business. Don't let me get into it after pointing a gun at her. Like, come on, bro. I wonder if she's gonna be back on that rock. She might be. I don't know. I'm basically taking the exact same path I used to get to her the first time. Oh, shit. We can get, we can get up that. Give it a run up. There we go. <laughs> nice. We did it. All right. I don't see her. There's no fire. Oh, there is a fire, but there's no lady in all white. I always feel like it always feels kind of sad for those people that are like. Always a little sad for the people, but especially when you get those missions. They're like, "Please find him," and then they're dead twenty years. Exhuming, exhuming, and some, some. Seth, putting a man in a grave. Oh no, you're a grave robber. Never mind. Excuse me, are you Seth? Who are you? I'm a friend of Mr. West Dickens. My name is Marston. John Marston. Goodbye, John Marston. It's been a great pleasure. I need your help, Seth. We need your help. Me and Mr. West Dickens. Let me be frank for one second, partner. I hate people. It was people who got me in this mess in the first place. What mess? Grave Robin. <laughs> Look at me. Look, I'm scrambling around. Look for maps, half insane. I ain't watched I have a map. six months. My hair falling out. My mind's going. What happened? I can pay you. My partner. He stole half my map. I never would have done that to him. Never. Look at me. Who did this to you? My partner. My boy, my man. My boy. What was this for? I don't have the facility to tell you what I would have done for that man. 
Then what I would do to him now? Why? Because he stole half my goddamn map! And what map's that, then? The map, partner! The map that tells me where it is! Where what is, friend? I ain't telling you that. I ain't. <laughs> Don't make me tell, partner! He's mine! He's mine! All mine! <laughs> sure. Sure. And where's this Moses now? Is this meant to... Oh! Some people, they feel differently. Not Moses. Just a bird. me. A oh, bird. The self same. Well, come on, Seth. Let's go see Moses. Get you your map back. Then maybe you'll help me. How ever did Mr. Diggins find a man like this? Come on then, partner. At least I don't have to lead him. Oh shit, we're, okay. We're just going straight across. Digging up graves and looting from the dead. Ha, hypocrites. The whole damn lot of you. Are you saying it's better to steal from the living? They're corpses. They don't care none. These people have been laid to rest. You don't know nothing. I talk to them long after they've been forgotten by every other fellow. I tell them it's all right to be scared and alone. I embrace them when they're stinking and rough. I met some sick bastards in my time, Seth. But you, you're special. Focus what the hell is that how? Their lives. To me, they get when they're actually cold and heartless. Surely that makes sense to even you. Not exactly, it don't. Are we really living anyway? Do you exist outside my mind? Maybe we're both having the same dream, and when we wake up, we'll die. I certainly seem to be <laughs> in some kind of nightmare. Maybe we're both having this undead nightmare! How about I play that for Halloween this year? That's ten months away. So stay tuned for that one. In the cave, Seth? <laughs> it's very dark. What'd you say? I, I didn't say nothing. I have a you feeling. I have a feeling that Moses is just his, his other self. I need his... someone who can get a wagon inside Fort Mercer. I was told you could help me, but I'm not sure you even know what day it is. I don't know what day it is. I can't even tell you what year it is. I knew this was a waste of time. So, you want to go after Bill Williamson, do you? You know Bill? Oh, yes. I met Williamson and Deke and all them boys. All Sometimes them boys. Sometimes they call me on when they get some special job needs doing. I got a reputation as a man who will do... Things most other fellas want. Now that I can believe. I reckon you can get in there, no bother. Assuming you help me find this map that is. Bro, I think this Moses guy is just a different part of Seth that laid the map somewhere. <laughs> but we're not gonna actually talk to a real person, I don't What's think. So important about this map? Nothing much. Just unimaginable riches and such like. A spark of hope that lit a rage and fire I can't put out. I thought as much. Another treasure hunter losing everything in the search for nothing. Oh, I lost it all, partner. My wife, my you children, had a wife? my business. Good Why? To them all. I don't eat, I don't sleep, I don't wash, and I don't care. I know. I can smell you. <laughs> he had a wife, child, it's and business, money. bro. What? I don't know who I am no more. I see myself, but it's like I'm looking at somebody else. Only it's me, you know? Maybe it's time you moved on. No way I can stop now. It's this is exactly over. why I'm thinking it's... There's no difference between night and day. Oh, I've been here. Whoa. I've definitely been here. I've sent Bucky All flying right. off that mountain many a time. Stop here a moment and come up with a plan. Where do we do, Seth? As far as I know, Moses is being held in that shack. There's a couple of deputies keeping guard outside. Can you distract him so I can sneak in for a quick parlay with that son of a bitch? I'm sure I can think of something. What do I do?
<laughs> he looks Leave so away weird. from the shack and out of sight. Somewhere out past that hill. Can I just shoot at them? This is one god awful assignment. I know. This place is deader than a side of bacon. Stop shooting at me! <laughs> Just run along the train track. It's easier. Don't lay a finger on them horses, mister. What's good? Yo, welcome back. How was your trip? How was your trip? Of course, a bounty still remains on my head. Ooh. Huh? Bro, what do you mean? What do you mean? I don't know. But you could you could have just said one word. Good. That's all I say. You know, I thought I was going to like play this for like half an hour, right? And well, maybe not half an hour, maybe like 2 hours in the max and get like and do the main mission, one of the big missions, like getting into Bill Williamson. Bro, what? I'm here. Okay. Good job getting rid of them clowns. Have you not been in yet? In case they come back. Do I have to shoot them? Moses? Oh, Moses! You got a visitor! Yeah, I don't think he's... Oh, he is a real person. Oh, it is a real person. Get the hell away from me! Get that slippery bastard! I'm gonna get that son of a bitch! Give me a... <laughs> the way he jumped through it. Hog tie. I don't really care to be honest. He can help me, and you can carry victim is wild. Whatever he told you, it's a lie. Bro, <laughs> he thinks he can run. Drop victim. Oh my gosh, John, you're so slow. <laughs> you can place a hog tie person on your horse. You must be stupid trusting that crazy bastard. You just wait till I get loose, mister. If that happens, I'ma shoot you. Where's my horse? I'll bring, I'll bring him a bit closer. So that he's ready. Let's see if he can interrupt the cutscene. Oh, cheers. Moses, you son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! Friend, this man's uh, gone crazy uh, in the sun. Uh, I suggest you take my advice and start talking. Shut up, Marston. I want to come to a bona fide man's uh, flesh. Ain't never bona fide. One before. Uh, odd, odd fellow's rest. It, it, it's an odd fellow's rest. Uh, get away from me once and for all. Well, ain't that a damn shame? I was starting to enjoy myself. Odd fellow's rest. That's the grave. I have just came from there. Did he be himself? Those deputies went and put a bounty on your head. Best we clear it now. Don't need the law on our backs. I don't have no money, but I got me a pardon letter. Oh! Here, take it. You earned it for helping me with the Moses. Uh. Come on. We can pay it off in the telegraph office. Uh. Uh. How does Come he on, have a pardon letter? Well, it's a hundred bucks less that I don't have to pay, so I appreciate it. Bernie's shown in the top right corner indicates the target on your back.
Here's a pardon letter. Two counts of murder, one count of horse theft. <laughs> and when did I murder people? I I don't know. So, Mister, thanks for your help. Don't worry yourself with thanks, Seth. Just help me when I come ask. You. No problem, Mister. No problem, Mister. Oh, there he goes. Alright. That's definitely gonna be unlawful though, don't it? Why don't you jump up? I will, just... In fact, I'm gonna move the horse off of the train. I'm surprised that you can't actually use the train in this game. Okay. Alright, horse. Oh wait, he's in here anyway, I know. <laughs> well, I blocked the entrance, didn't I? We'll go this way. Look at this man. My, my, take a look at you. Will you take a look at you? That sounds zesty. You look like you've seen trouble, mister. Enough for a hundred men. Trouble has a way of finding me, mister. Mister? Oh, I like the sound of that. Do I ever like the sound of that? Trouble with a capital T. That's just capital. What, what is... He say? Cold. What he say? Tough, but with a heart of gold. The cowboy sings his lonely song like like a dog whose bone is made of wood. Excuse me? Oh, nothing. I, I was just writing my next piece. I've been uh, is he a poem? Here to provide a little frontier joie de vie for the ladies back east. Like Saint Denis. I don't understand a word you're saying, mister. Yeah, my mom felt the same way. And now she wrote me out of her will, and there's no hope for any of us. <laughs> Jimmy Saint? Ah, uh, Saint Denis! Uh, at your disposal. But uh, please don't dispose of me just yet. <laughs> what are you doing out here, Jimmy? Capturing Jimmy. the spirit of the West for a monthly back east. You know, I'm uh, sending them my oh so witty and oh so pertinent missives and gaining myself a little prize in the bargain. So it's action I'm after, and action I'm gonna find too. <laughs> Wild men, cheap women, you know, guns, that sort of thing. Okay. Well, you have fun. Interesting. Fun. <laughs> I'm gonna have the time of my life, sport. Sport. You, <laughs> it's definitely good sport in this life. life. Funny man, generally. Wait, he, he didn't have a... He didn't have a... He didn't have a... I'll tell you, mister, that... You have fun. Oh, I don't have enough notes to scroll. Okay. Inactive. What do you mean, inactive? He's traveling around to observe life at the last frontier. Ah. Kind of strange man. So officer said his son went missing in the hill. Oh yeah, I haven't said I haven't been <laughs> I got killed by a pig last time I went up there. Seems to know a lot about your past and claims to plan. Oh to know you from your days during the Dutch Vandalin gang. He asked you if you would go to Thieves Landed to check on his friend who of his who's drunk and thinking of cheating on his wife. The man did not explicitly say stop him just to advise him on how to best proceed. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Uh, he's looking to drill for water in the area, but the old man who lives in the Pleasant's house won't cooperate. Travel northwest of Armadillo and find a way to land de to la get the land deed. Funny man, inactive. I guess that means we haven't progressed through the story enough to like continue his, because I guess it's like somewhere else. Probably Blackwater. Oh shit! Oh shit! Wait, Seth, I, I swear I heard his name, bro. I swear that was his name. Oh, fuck, he's all the way back here. I don't really want to do this. But his missions haven't seemed too bad, so... And it might get me closer to Bill. Oh, shit, that hit me. Huh. 
me, bro. Move in there, mister. Oh, I was about to ride straight across the train line. Until yeah, the train came. Can I? I'm assuming I can rob the train. That'd be pretty cool. Oh, I see. Oh. You killed Kenny. Bastard. <laughs> you killed Kenny. You bastard. I'm going to loot the other guy too. Oh, I'm gonna loot the other guy. Alright, where is this man? Mr. W. I've been doing a lot of writing in this video. Well, this live stream. I always say video. I haven't done a video in nine months. And the last last video was literally just a clip. But anyway. Five AM and ten PM. Can't we Oh, oh shit! <laughs> You, sir. I'm all right. I met up with your friend Seth. Oh, <laughs> Seth of the Dead. <laughs> yes, <laughs> interesting fellow. <laughs> you don't meet many men these days with the moral fortitude to cut straight to the chase like that, do you? <laughs> hmm. <laughs> not, Mr. West Dickens. Yes, Mr. West Dickens. Society is remarkably That's like saying the hard R, bro. Like, calm down. But did you know that in ancient Egypt, it was an art form valued more highly than literature? I believe Seth comes from that school of thought. <laughs> How very interesting. Look, you thought any more about our plan? Ah, your plan, dear boy. Your plan. I am merely the help, not mercifully the arbiter of wisdom. What you are, dear boy, is the man whose life I've saved twice now. A man who sells lies and deceit to unwitting people. A man who, if he doesn't help me, I won't think twice about putting a bullet through his skull, feeding to the vultures myself. Uh, you see, Mr. Marston, you have the exterior of a violent man, but the soul of an angel, and that is what I think I cherish most about you. But before we can attend to your particular problems, uh, um, we need some extra lubricant to oil the machinery <laughs> of business, and uh, this being America, <clears throat> that lubricant with which we concern ourselves <clears throat> is money. Money? <clears throat> what are you talking about? Oh, we need weapons, armor plate for the wagon, extra hands, <clears throat> and I need some danger money. So. Let's sell some more of these cures. Sell cures? Around here? Do you want to see me lynched? <laughs> no. The sport of kings. Racing, my friend. The sport of kings. A noble activity without reproach. Exactly the kind of activity where a lying, cheating He's so like, like myself can prosper. <laughs> but come. Let's finish the loading and we'll discuss it as we drive. Ah, uh, driving again. Okay. Now, sir, to Gap Tooth Bridge. Gap Tooth. Ah, oh, I've been there. It's on the way to... Skip to destination. Oh, yes! He's driving! I'm not... I ain't waiting all that time. Nice. My horse following. It is. Why are these people cheering? 
All right. Interesting that we got a crowd. I don't want to start a race. What? Since when? What? Move the fuck out of the way. <laughs> I took him out. Shooting other races of spectators will call you to be disqualified. Why would I need to shoot them? Are they going to shoot me? Is that why? Is it because I'm new? So I can't shoot anyone? Oh shit, we got a sharp tank. I'm... Slow down a little bit. Oh no, never mind. This... Oh fucking hell, this guy... This guy's st handling is crazy. What do you mean, one of... What? One of eight laps? Are you talking about... Are you telling me I'm gonna do eight laps of this shit? You know, if you can't backwards, why would I need to move backwards? I guess it's in case I crash into anything. I'm assuming I probably won't end up doing all eight laps. I hope. <laughs> Fucking pray. Holy shit, that... <laughs> Never met a better horse cart than you, boy. I say that. Would you like to be placed on the course? Those will not be. Yes. I can catch up. Oh, no. It's ranked. Okay. I'll catch up. Don't even fucking worry. I sort of... Okay. Yep, let's just restart this shit. <laughs> I was doing so well and then I went straight instead of turning. Let's go. Straight through. Straight through. You're a gladiator, John. I'm a gladiator! Shooting other races. Why would I ever need to shoot other races? If I'm winning. I'm assuming sometimes you can... Alright, here we go. Big U10. Good job, boy. I don't usually like races, as I've said in the past, but I don't mind this one. This one's alright. Because these horses have pretty good handling. Oh shit, there is a guy catching. Okay, now we speed up a little bit. I got a turn left here. Don't fuck it up. Okay. Right. So I guess we're trying to sell to these guys. To prove it, we're going, we're doing better than every other one. That's what I assume, because I skipped the entire journey over here. I just said the handling was really good on this guy, but then he just, like, rammed into a wall. Oh, fuck, I fucked up again. Oh, no, I didn't, never mind. I just took a shortcut. Speed up a little bit, because fuck is behind me. I think we got two more. I gotta keep some shit for the end. No, from last time, you can just power it home at the end. We won't need to, though.
There we go. Well done. Hell of a race, mister. I'll take care of this cart for Mr. West Dickens. Come on, John. I suggest we keep a patient. Why? What did we do? I'm getting on. Right. Best remove ourselves from the stage before somebody decides they want their money back. Ah. Uh. Wasn't that fantastic? The cheers of the crowd. Ah, oh, so we did. The wheels. Falling rocks. The homicidal maniac. Oh, the come on, John. Even a cold-hearted misanthrope like you must have found that just the tiniest bit exhilarating. Not the this is crazy. Bunch, are they? they take the racing very seriously in these parts. And your participation was not entirely free of food. That was clear. <laughs> well, he's so far ahead, it wasn't that clear. Guilty pleasures of mankind since the dawn of time. I'd get away from the men we just swindled before you start waxing too lyrical. Yes, yes, you live cards. Alright, let's skip to the location. Oh, we're back here. Fun. Well done, sir. Well done. Having you as a ringer has netted us a fine profit. <laughs> we seem to be wasting time, old man. Oh, patience, my friend. The Trojan horse cannot run before it can walk, if you'll forgive the metaphor. Next, we need to procure some grand and overwhelming firepower. And for that, you need to contact an old friend of mine. Goes by the name of Irish. Irish? Yes, uh, he's an interesting kind of fellow. Um, he usually can be found in uh, Armadillo or some other town around here on some Bacchanalian revel or such. Uh, Sad thing is it's not Sean, because Sean got shot in the face. What could be better? I'll be honest. I'm gonna have to do this later. I thought we would be, like we would have done the mission by now. Three bucks! We sure ain't get paid a lot. Why does he have another mission? Or could his other mission possible to do it again? So, we got Nigel West. We got... I don't know. What was his broken job? We got Irish. <laughs> and then we got Seth. Alright, we're sending up missions for the next view the next video I did say next video because with that I would like to say thank you guys so much for watching please comment like subscribe if you up for it and I'll see y'all in the next one alright peace out